20 ships working 24 hours a day in all the world's oceans. Guardline Marine Sciences is a global operation. The business is only as good as the people who make the team. And we're going to meet some of the team behind Guardline's success. No one knows marine sciences like Guardline. Our ships are floating laboratories, scanning and mapping the oceans of the world. The Ocean Researcher is one of our ever-expanding fleet. Her name says it all. The team on board the Ocean Researcher is close. They spend months at sea working in extreme conditions. It's their dedication and passion that makes them the best. Guardline's a family company, even though it's been going 40 years, and offshore was for one big family. As a, a Guardline offshore party chief on a vessel like the Ocean Researcher, I oversee all aspects of the survey operations from mobilisation to uh, data acquisition and then give the client the end quality product. Away from the hardware on the deck is the data. This is where the information comes in, showing the scientists just what is on and under the ocean floor. This is where the survey data is processed. Readings and seismic findings are interpreted right here. And it's not just seabed surveys. Nautical charts are made here too. Wrecks, changing sandbanks and coastlines mean it's a non-stop job. We collect this from all around the world, really. We have ships working in uh, Brazil, West Africa, Australia, uh, Mediterranean, and then obviously a lot in the North Sea and uh, wherever we collect that data, we bring it back here into Great Yarmouth to do the interpretation. We have to process a lot of the data to produce really good images that we can um, understand what's going on on the seabed and underneath the seabed, and then we do our geophysical interpretation of that and produce reports for the clients. The team's experience is vital for the safety of those who work offshore. A lot of the work is based on safety hazards for oil companies, so before they can go and actually stick a rig on the seabed and start drilling, we have to make sure it's safe for them to do that. Guardline has been working in the oil and gas industry since 1969 and is now taking that expertise and using it to harness green energy. This project is helping companies create renewable energy. From start to finish, Guardline, no wind farms. Well, with Guardline's 40 years experience with the oil and gas industry, we've developed vast knowledge of the seabed, and we're now transferring that knowledge into renewables. The same type of survey, geophysical surveys, geotechnical surveys have to be done for wind farms as the oil and gas industry. We're involved in renewables now, and a big push the whole of Europe to get into renewables. Over a thousand turbines now being built within this area, it's sort of you know, free energy for everyone. Like with all projects in Guardline Marine Sciences, there's usually more than one thing happening on the same vessel. I'm part of the Marine Wildlife Department and my role is a Marine Mammal Observer. This means that we go out on our boats before making any noise in the marine environment. People like myself have to monitor the area around um, a vessel or around a wind farm to make sure there are no mammals in the area. Now, our environmental department certainly has grown very much over the last few years and it's very important to us that uh, we do as much to as we can to protect the environment while also carrying out the jobs that are necessary for our company. From mammals to the tiniest sea creatures, it's all monitored to safeguard the future of our marine ecosystems. This is the team at Marine Ecological Surveys. They're working on preserving our oceans for the future. We secure samples from the seafloor, we bring them back to the laboratory and then my guys process them through the laboratory. Some samples can have 30 species in them, some can have 500. And all of those species have to be counted, weighed, identified. This dedicated team has written hundreds of reports for clients. Almost all of my team have wanted to be marine biologists since age 10. 
and nothing was going to sway them. It's not a job, it's a vocation. It's something which we all love. and We are all passionate about the environment and doing as much as we can in order to secure our future. Guardline's work is, of course, international. Specialist survey teams operate anywhere in the world with the latest technology producing the most accurate results. New York is the home of Alpine Ocean, part of the Guardline family. It's very exciting right now. I mean, we're part of the Guardline group. Uh, it's given us a lot of opportunity. We're going to be expanding quite a bit. Uh, new technologies are coming online, which Alpine is very involved with. And there's a lot of new parts of our field that are coming online in the United States. Uh, wind farm, alternative energy offshore, it's all new territory. And being part of a Guardline group is a very strong position in the industry. The Alpine Ocean, if you want anything done offshore in the coastal waters, from geophysics, bathymetry, sediment sampling, barge positioning, anything you want, we can do. This team specializes in geophysics and oceanography. They've carried out thousands of projects around the world and developed their own equipment for specific projects. This is Alpine's pontoon boat. With only a two-foot draft, they can get to really shallow waters others can't. I'm the uh, senior geologist. I set up projects with clients to determine exactly what it is that they want to do. This pontoon boat is a nice stable platform for us to use in shallow waters like this. We're only in about three or four feet of water here. Our ability to put together a team with all of these different capabilities, our own survey vessels, we can provide a complete package from A to Z. It's all done in-house. Guardline Marine Sciences. The people. The vessels. The expertise. With over 1,300 employees based around the world, Guardline has got it covered.